straight at us and we've got a tight one. So if we clump down to something safer like a four iron, a two iron, something like that, then we may have a longer distance in. So inevitably we pull driver. Now how can we be confident and comfortable to hit that club and find the fairway? So what we need to have is what I call a, a fairway finder. And they talk about it a lot. You hear Tiger talking about, I can hit driver there, but I have to fit it. You hear people talking about uh, their fairway finder, their go-to swing with their driver. And everybody's is different. I wanna share what I do. I don't change the height of my tee. I keep that consistent. But what I do do is I'm gonna make a very smooth takeaway. So I wanna make my, my back swing nice and smooth. And then I want to really focus on trying to hit a cut. So this video is kind of for more of you advanced players. If you don't know how to hit a cut, um, go back, find a video where we talk about the way that you can create a cut pattern or a fade pattern. Okay. And basically for me, what that means is really turning hard uh, to the right and holding the face from closing or releasing. Okay. And so I aim down the right side and I just feel that kind of might even do a few rehearsal swings of okay really feeling that left side for me hold that face open all right in the finish so let's give it a shot see if we can miss all those bumps confident with that shot I'm able to turn through that there's not a lot of guesswork I don't have to match my release pattern in a very specific way I just turn to the right one of my favorite drivers of the golf ball ever is Carl Pedersen and Carl's a bigger guy <laughs> and what Carl does so well is he just hits these beautiful little cuts and finds the fairway and you know little he probably hits a three plus but um, Try that, find something that's your go-to fairway finder, and uh, I think it'll help you lower your scores. Mahalo.